the thrift store. Worked my way back to the Valentine area to see if they got anything. Always look back here for planters. They might have. Oh, they got some usable Valentine window stickers. Oh, not what I thought they were. Well, they got bunches of them. <laughs> so if you're in the mood for that, some paw holders. They look like they're all paw holders. And they're scented for a dollar. Easter. I'm sure these are ordered. No ground steaks, five dollars. Like candy cups, eight crackers. There's some things. That bunny looks like it's getting physical on its side. Now oh, these are kind of cute. They're made in China. Candle holders for seven dollars. This is glass. It's four. And it's Dollar Tree. Hen laying chick, a collectible item, even says collectible on it. Four dollars. It's got the sticker saying it works. It's kind of cute. That was a bank missing its bottom. So there's the bottom. There's where you put the coins in. for four dollars. That's some plates and little cups. What's that a bit? That's kind of cute as a book. It's a dollar. do my scarf it was choking me as I kept bending down <laughs> oh look at the paper plates okay not finding much in the Easter goods for that. 
hand painted home. That looks like tar probably Target, 50 cents. I don't know, I like it, I'm gonna get it because I can craft with it. First thing in my cart, 50 cents. Oh, that's glass for three dollars. There's a mold, cake mold, a lamb. Two seventy-five. There's a bunny candle. Oh, rough shape. Let's see if they have any good, good paper. That's natural. Bridal shower. Current for a dollar. Christmas. I'll skim over that pretty quick. Just see if there's anything. You never know when you're gonna find something really cute that you really really want. Some plushies. With the tags. They are GANs. I wonder if they're worth looking up. Three fifty each. Hmm. I might have to lift them up. There's a whole barrel of them. So I did decide to get some of the cats. They seem to be worth the most. There's a basset hound. Then there's the duck. And that's all I saw in here. So I just picked up a couple of them. I do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of the cats. And they are three fifty each. Let's look at the wood stuff too, just to see if there's anything worth picking up. Oh look, a pair of wooden shoes. For fifteen dollars. Made in Holland. The figurine now. Come on, something going to be good. She's probably Japan. Possibly. She's a dollar. I might, I might think about her. Let me put it back here. New York City. 50 cents. She's cute. She's a dollar. Look at her. I don't see any chips. Now 
that is unique. <laughs> My goodness. Oh, it's, it's uh, ceramic. I found a May, but her wings are broken. She's 50 cents. I don't think I'm going to get her. See if there's anything inside it. I don't think there is. Nope. Yeah. I'm gonna do a quick pass of the scrapbooking now. Music slider over here. I don't know what it is. I always get hungry when I'm in here. Today is no exception. Oh my gosh, look at that raffia. Oh my goodness. A twist ribbon or I have some of this. It is vintage. It's a squishy bowl. What does that say? A long row of candles. we got here while you were out neon so like orange pink and yellow I wish there was just the uh, manila color oh sealed 20 cards typewriter notes the timeless appeal of the typewriter it's only two dollars I might get that Ooh, what you got up here oh notepad cooking, cooking for something fun well wishes So back from the thrift store, and you're probably curious, what did I pick up? I got a lot of those stuffed animals that I showed in the big pail. And this video, well, when I went there, is it was before Valentine's Day. And uh, so I'm just now getting to the whole portion. But these are the Gans. And I know they're not vintage, but hey, quick seller for Easter, I'm all about it. So I want to get these up on eBay, hopefully this weekend. And they still have their tags. And you can see I paid $3.50. So I got the cat and the duck. Um, bunches of them. I think, what, nine total. I got this coffee cup. It is Target for $0.50. Cents, but I thought, how cute would that be with, um, like, for an assemblage, a bunny, Something like that. A couple mercury beads. That kind of thing. St. Patrick's Day. 75 cents. In the package still. So great for if you want to surprise somebody with the card. And throw a bunch of confetti in it. So when they pull the card out it makes a mess. This little angel girl. A dollar. 
and she has another tag underneath her. So I don't know if that was like in another place and it didn't sell because she looks a lot like the Japan pieces, but I'm gonna have to try to hair dry that tag off of there and see what it's all about. 50 cents. I remember when Crafts had this tag and you would go to a hobby store or something like that and you would see these up on the um, cork board. So, little Amish girl, figure I can use her for crafting, I don't know. I mean, it's so hard for me to pass up things for 50 cents. Because I always think, I can do something with them. This was a dollar. I liked her because she had a kitty cat. She has some numbers on the bottom. This, surprisingly, is worth some money. Who knew? I paid $2 for it. Actually, it's upside down. Typewriter notes. It's still sealed. Here's the back. But these went for, I think it was like $17 on eBay. It's been a while since I checked those comps. But I think that's what it said. This I got to craft with. It's on a little pillow. I'm going to take the kitty cat off. Because um, I'm just not into uh, fabric for decor. I have a lot of this from the 80s and 90s. Late 80s, early 90s when my kids were small. And it just got dirty. So I have it packed away in a box somewhere. Two dollars. But she's cute. And she has a little ruffled dress on there. This frozen Charlotte on the stand with her movable arms. Three dollars for her. And last up, let me check. Feels like it's gonna fall over. Uh, yeah, everything else is cats and ducks. Is this Hager stork planter? I paid. Where's the price at? Three dollars. And still has the sticker on the back. Some numbers on the bottom. But I don't see any chips or cracks. So that's always good. <laughs> because I tend to get these home and it's like, oh man. But I don't see anything. So again, I'll probably, I don't know, I'll probably make something out of it. Or who knows, maybe I'll like have it on a live sale or, you know, something like that. So that's it. These I want to get up because Easter's only weeks away. But I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe.